Hello there. This is Shadow Seven Two Two One. Didn't expect me to talk during the intro, did you? And today I'm going to be doing two things really. I'm going to be testing out my new microphone. This is a Platronics USB audio with headphones and all that stuff. And I'm also going to be showing off. Yes, I'm using word showing off. A few of my scratched discs, which I've got over the period of time, and um, uh, my good friend Mark from Game Masters UK is going to be cleaning them. And well, he might be cleaning for I don't know. It depends whether it's the post, whether he's worried about money or something to do with his cleaner. And um, yeah, this first one here is Worms Armageddon for the PS1, and as you can see. It will load after this logo, but it takes about an hour, so, yeah. And, uh, that's that. So, Start your engine! Oh, that's not a computer entertainment year of production! Getting pumped up. This is Crash Team Racing, in case you can tell. And this is my good copy, which I got, which I borrowed from my nephew. Fasten your seatbelts for another naughty oh, dog well creation! And I borrowed it from my neck in the back. It's not like a frame box now. Um, I borrowed it from my neck in 2002 and never gave it back. And as you can see, it freezes during the intro. You can skip the intro, I and mean, then it's a 50 50 chance of whether it will freeze, loading the main menu, or loading the race. So, yeah, that's that one. Well, I'm actually doing this for Mark's purpose because he wants to know why I've. Uh, why I'm sending him a disc and why they're scratched. This, although you couldn't tell, is actually Tekken 5 Freezer Doom and Namco logo. Simple as that. This game here, Vigilante 8 Second Offense, it's an old favourite of mine. It does actually work, but only one soundtrack works on it out of all the 15 songs. Only one works. So, I'm just showing that now. Yeah. That one doesn't work. Uh, that one doesn't work. So yeah, I'm going to be sending all these games to Mark through uh, the post. Uh, give him a bit of money so he can send them back to me. And he's going to make a Dewing video on his channel Game Busters UK or the Game Buster Mark. I don't know which. He'll choose probably the former. And uh, he'll... yeah, <laughs> that one does sort of work, but not really. And uh, he's just going to be cleaning them. That'll be probably be quite boring. I'll probably cut some of that out. And, uh, and he's going to send them back to me. And I'll do an after video on this channel. And I'll see if, if the, the discs work. If he's only going to send a few discs, then... Uh, this one here is Star Wars Battlefront, by the way. Yeah. Freezes while loading the game. And uh, if he... If it's not a postage problem as to why money related as to why he only wants me to send four then I'll be sending him Crash Bash, Crash Team Racing, Tekken 5 and oh by the way now it's just moved on to Star Wars Battlefront 2 actually believe it or not yeah this is Star Wars Battlefront 2 now pretty much the same problem and uh, I'll be sending him yeah Tekken 5, the two Crash games Crash Team Racing and Crash Bash and Soul Calibur 3 one copy of it Yep, that's, this is coming up now, Soul Calibur 3 now. And I actually have two copies of this, uh, because one, well, broke. I got it, I remember I got it on New Year's Day 2006 from my local Curry's, I think it was. It could be Comets. They, they're both right next to each other. So, that was fun. They're both, op well, adjacent to a Sainsbury's. So, quite a bit of... Welcome there. to the new stage of history. Yeah, the new stage doesn't have any background music. And there is a bit of frame rate. My settings wasn't working, as you can sort of tell. But, um... What I'm just showing you is that the background music is actually on, but it's not playing. So yeah, in the middle of that recording, I actually switched from one disc to the other. You see, now, now the frame rate's fine. As you see, some songs work, but this one doesn't. And, uh... Yeah, because one loaded all the way up to main menu, got up almost to the main menu, and this is the other copy, and I believe it's the 
new one I'm just talking about, not the one I got from eBay. So I'm just going to do a straight game. Epic music, so you fairly good And, uh, Yes, loading. It's still loading, epic music. Well, uh, this definitely brings a new meaning to the term shadow games. If you get back to it, Calibre 3. This next one, I think, is Mortal Kombat Armageddon. Is it Mortal Kombat Armageddon? Uh, yeah, it must be. And I, I know this isn't the most routine of videos, and you'll probably already stop by now. But um, it's really just mostly to test my new headset. And yeah, this is Mortal Kombat Armageddon. And it's... Oh, it's gone back to the menu. So I'll go on it again. And, uh, yeah. So I'm just testing my new headset. It's quite a good one. I personally would recommend it. And, uh, I'm just showing Mark the problems so he can have an idea of whether or not the disc will work and fix some stuff or not. Some of these games are about a decade old, actually. Literally one decade old. Crush Bash, I got. Um, I think it was Christmas 2001 I got that. I'm not sure. That was also, I think, the only present I ever opened early. Actually, it might have been my birthday in 2002 for my, for my big brother. And, yeah, now it's not going back to PlayStation menu this time. It's just going to freeze completely. So that's fun. Yeah. So, more combat Armageddon not working either. And now for the last game, here we are, this is Crash Bash, and like I said, Birthday 2002 I think it was, it's the only prison I ever opened early in my entire life, and yeah, as you can see, it's not going to get past this menu, I actually have another copy, but that just freezes while loading anything. So, thank you very much for watching, see you next time, Shadow out.